Okay, Frank and Sue, I thought I would just give you a brief demonstration of hammer hanging or hammer installation, whatever you want to call it. This here is glue. I've been letting it sit here for a little while. It's a little goopy. Um, I've got a couple of hammers here that I'm going to glue right around here uh, next to the guide hammer. This is number 40 hammer, which is your middle C and it is glued on at an 8 degree angle and uh, what I do first is of course I have a protractor that I use to guide me and figure out the angle of all these hammers that I glue on <clears throat> so in this particular cluster of four hammers we have uh, an 8 degree angle so the first thing I do is uh, take some glue apply it on the holes of these two hammers and get it to go in there real well. We need plenty of glue um, to do this, of course, because we want the joint to be really solid. And after I've got my glue on the hammer heads, I will now put a little bit of glue on the two different hammer shanks that I'm going to be working with. This is number 41. I put a dollop of glue on the end of the hammer shank and now I'm moving this one around, give it a twirl, make sure the glue works its way on the shank and the hammer and uh, place it on the jig here. And now I'm going to do number 39. A little dollop of glue there, give a twirl, remove the excess glue. Another twirl, stick it on there. And now, of course, uh, it has to line up all in a straight line. And so for that, I have a straight edge, which I can now use to guide these new hammers onto the jig next to the hammer in the middle. And then, of course, I check the angles of these hammers as they're drying, or as I'm positioning them with the guide hammer. And I can use either side for my guides. Um, this hammer was previously glued and these two hammers were previously glued and of course this one was previously glued. So these are uh, quite solid guide guides for me to get these new hammers on. And I've done a little bit of that already with the base tonight. I glued a group of three here, numbers 2, 3, and 4, and 14, 15, 16, and 23, 24, 25, and I've used my guides. Again, this is five and a half degrees here. As I said earlier, this is eight degrees. And of course now, <clears throat> I'm ready to do yet another group of three hammers or two hammers, depending. I'll probably glue 28, 29, and 30 next. But <clears throat> as I uh, do this job, of course, I take a look down the site and make sure that the hammers remain in a straight line. And that is basically it. Um, here's a closer look at the hammers that I just glued on. And we're just going to let them dry there while I work on three more elsewhere. And that's a quickie look at hammer hanging.